This car is the first performance car that General Motors has done that's gonna have either zero neutral lift or negative lift. And the objective for the ZL1 in terms of aerodynamics was to improve the lift performance, was to try to get it as neutral as possible and possibly generate downforce. An aero is tied obviously into the chassis dynamics of the vehicle. So anytime you're improving the lift or reducing the lift, your cornering capability, your braking capability, all gets enhanced. And that we know through simulation, there's a direct correlation with the amount of lift improvement you get and the lap times you get out here at MRC or other racetracks. I am Tom Froling, lead development engineer, aerodynamics for General Motors. But also, I'm a retired F-16 pilot. We used two different wind tunnels and computational fluid dynamics, or CFD. So we can do real in-depth studies of the air particles as they flow around and through the brake ducts. We've been in G-Mall, which is the GM Aero Lab wind tunnel, for about 100 hours of wind tunnel development. A lot of times when regular engineers are sleeping, we were in the wind tunnel developing a lot of the features you see on this car. We typically do our development at 110 kph, or roughly 66 miles per hour. The vehicle sits on this full-scale balance here, and we measure all the aero coefficients. We decided to develop a splitter, and what that is doing is reducing the lift on the car. Extractor provides a cooling flow improvement and a front lift improvement. Front wheel extension that helps with lift and helps also with our brake cooling. Providing more cooling flow because of the increased horsepower. We have a unique rocker for the ZL1 that can offer a drag reduction and also a lift enhancement. The rear spoiler is unique to the ZL1. The splitter, the tire dams, the belly pan system, the brake ducts, lap times at like MRC and Nurburgring. You can see how all these modifications translate into a hard lap time and you can quantify and say, you know, we made the car go faster.